and then, and then, yeah. So uh, you can also tell him that this is actually a place, and what this is built up, we can basically try to. Uh, the location that, that is and what it does is uh, oh no that's, so that's not actually let me try again and then um, big so that the pass will go back here. Uh, okay. You can say, for example, Kenya. Go to Kenya, and hopefully you have. Yeah. So yeah. Kenya works. Uh, go to Mozambique. But the real idea here is you don't have to have this structure. Uh, ideally, you can have a very free structure of uh, the place you wanted to go. So, ideally, could I run old radio or television footage through it, and it could start mapping out the entities or the people and individuals and places mentioned in there? You, you should be able to. Uh, like, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that you can have. And you have, you're sitting with a man text. with a very large radio broadcast organization. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So every time the radio mentions a place, you have the map just pop up. Oh, it's like, okay. yeah, we're supposed to. I mean, you could start we don't really have color. Reportage, yeah. And you can start linking it to the use use individual entities. Colors, and then company names, people company names, 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 politicians. Yes. politicians um, both as an internal yeah. asset management system. Yeah, I used so to use you could call that very thing mentioning. Oh, Who's your next president? Donald Trump. The really amazing thing is that the scary thing is that with that I, AI was bought by Facebook. Yeah, recently. Um, but uh, if your project is public yeah. and it contributes to the public uh, training database, it's free. That's fine. Uh, I don't see that as a problem. Right, I don't see that as a problem. Too fast to get up to yeah. yeah. And like when it was brought by Facebook, it uh, supported like five different languages, and now I think it's seven or eight. Yeah, so maybe like in the near future. Which are the which are the languages? Uh, so French, Port Portuguese, uh, English, so mostly like European, uh, Arabic. Yeah. I'm not sure. Because <laughs> French, Portuguese, and English we have in Africa, so we just need Arabic and then. I'm not sure if I'm not sure if I'm not sure if I'm not sure if I'm not I'm not sure if I'm not this is very cool. Yeah, it's very easy to build. Like uh, six or seven hour waste the surveys, and you have a working like uh, voice control. Yeah, well, we're gonna, I'm gonna experiment on this. Yeah, I'm also curious about putting it at the other end of like a voice control. Oh, you know, so you call and you ask for information and then text it to you. Scripting. <laughs> In a country where we don't have access okay. to the internet, or to oh. computers, you can do voice search. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. In fact, voice I request want that, that sends you a text message, or even a WhatsApp, yeah. or a kind of yeah. chat, yeah. which is free. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's fun. That's very powerful. And if you train it, it could be around election information. Yeah, election. Well, I want a special place, what's the party. That's very that's powerful. Yeah. Okay, well, yeah. that was very cool. This one I'm going to steal. <laughs> <laughs> please do, please do. Please do.